Hello. Well, my name is Vic Ludwig, and this is just some of my favourite memories of the NTFL, and my club is St Mary's. Oh, well, I've got many, many, not so many favourites, I guess, but over the years, I've been from very memorable moments. You know, you never get sick of winning grand finals, that's certainly right. And over the years, we've had some really fantastic players playing for St Mary's Footy Club. Almost 100, I think it was pretty close to 100 premierships while I was uh, president of St Mary's. That was in 1964, when I first became president. I stayed on for uh, 42 years and uh, but you don't even get that for murder, do you? <laughs> <laughs> My marriage, Sadie uh, McGuinness, she was a Buffalo supporter, belonged to all the Buffaloes, but I was lucky I converted her over to St Mary's and she was a great soul stalwart of St Mary's Footy Club. Had uh, five kids and they're all uh, supporters of St Mary's. And whether it's good or bad, um, my youngest son is now the president of St Mary's Footy Club. We talk about tough footballers. Can I talk about tough footballers? One of my first players was a, would be a player named Edmund Johnson. He started on the wing, but he was the toughest. He was, he was a great player. North Adelaide came up on, on a trip and their full forward kicked 106 goals for the year. He was a gun. This Edmund Johnson stood him and he was gone by half time. They, they had to take him away. He never got a kick. Never got a kick. Edmund was all over him like a rash. And uh, it turns out he was 43 years old when he was playing in that rep game. 43. No regrets about having anything to do with St Mary's. Great people, you know. It's a family club and the People, are, you know, the Iggy Vallejo and those people, they, you know, they're just like sons of mine. <laughs>